Well, right now, three counter police officers are recovering after being shot during a tense standoff near the parish line. One of them just released from the hospital. This as support for them is really pouring in from fellow officers, deputies, even regular neighbors from across the state. The BDSU's Ariel Brumfield joins us now with details on some of those victims. Ariel. Well, like you said, Randy, that good news is that all of those officers are now home recovering. The suspect, 31-year-old Matthew Lathers, he was shot dead by police yesterday, but he shot two people yesterday morning, and that's how that SWAT roll started, and things escalated and obviously turned deadly. Now, we have updates for from Kenner investigators. They say that Lathers shot those two people on Farm Street who were on their way to church. One victim, a 62-year-old, was shot in the arm, and the second victim, a 44-year-old, was shot in the abdomen. Now, police say they had been looking for Lathers since Tuesday. Lathers was identified as the alleged gunman who was shot or who, excuse me, who shot and injured a 56 year old man during a robbery. We're told Jefferson Parish deputies held the SWAT role at a home on Farm Street and tried to negotiate Lathers to come out for eight hours. Investigators say that eventually officers did go inside the house. Lathers opened fire, shooting three officers before he was shot and killed by a JPSO sniper. Now we're also told we're going to be getting some updates from Kenner police and just a bit. We'll keep you updated as we know more on this investigation. Back to